Hi, Ben Yao, Torque Trends Incorporated with the electric Miata. Some of you saw this car at the SEMA show. Many have seen it online on videos. What we wanted to do was bring you a couple of upgrades that we've done since you last saw the car. Brakes, for example. Well, we started originally with Willwood uh, brakes in the front, uh, larger vented uh, rotors and four piston calipers. We had stock brakes in the rear. Now we've upgraded and we have a vented larger diameter rotor in the rear with aluminum hats. We're still running the stock Miata caliper, but with Porterfield number four, very aggressive track pads. Great for autocross. We had Yokohama A008s on the car. They're a great tire. They're, they're street legal, but for the track, we needed to get serious. We were running uh, a 17 inch rim in the rear and 16s in the front for the look that we wanted. But for, for racing, we went back to a 15 inch all the way around. These are Inkies. They only weigh 11.2 pounds per wheel. And of course, the tire is lighter because it's smaller. This is a Hoosier A7 race tire. It's a 225-45-15 with a speed rating of 81W. That's 165 mile per hour. I knocked about 40 pounds off the car. That's great. Now, both the wheels and the tires came from our new sponsor, the Tire Rack. This is a slick. It's a very soft compound, very sticky, which means it's very sensitive to alignment. The alignment has to be correct or you're going to wear out tires very, very prematurely. A great tire for the track, a great tire for autocross. With these two upgrades, we're expecting some big improvements in our track times. Thanks for watching this video.